Hidden beneath the highways and streets of Washington, D.C. is a sprawling infrastructure of hundreds of thousands of assets. Water distribution pipes, valves, collection pipes, manholes, water meters, and fire hydrants. The infrastructure here is aging. The average age of a pipe in D.C. is 77 years, with some pipes dating back to the Civil War. Maintaining and operating such a complex and aging system with thousands of moving parts had been an ongoing challenge for the District of Columbia Water and Sewer Authority, also known as DC Water, which is responsible for the delivery of water services to more than 600,000 people with hundreds of miles of pipes and mains. For years, this system had been maintained with paper records which meant engineers had to go through file after file to find the status of a certain broken pipe or part that needed to be replaced. The work of water in cities everywhere relies heavily on the ability to monitor and understand vast amounts of data. And keeping everything running smoothly, from the tracking of problems, to managing work orders, to dispatching maintenance crews in a timely manner and to where they're needed the most is a monumental task. DC Water had already begun to improve its system with asset management and preventive maintenance technologies from IBM. The next step was to bring in something that was more predictive in nature. Enter a team from IBM Research and Global Business Services that was exploring the emerging field of analytics-driven asset management. Using descriptive analytics, predictive modeling, and optimization software, this new solution would be able to analyze all kinds of information from multiple sources. DC Water was looking to modernize its age-old system, streamline its business processes, and provide a higher level of service to the customers it served. The IBM team had several analytical technologies and solution concepts but needed a real-world scenario in which to apply them. And so, in October 2009, a contract was signed and another first-of-a-kind project was born. The two teams then held a series of meetings to review the water company's various pain points and explore how technology could be brought in to help, from analyzing infrastructure defects to better understanding water use based on time of year, location, and amount used, to enabling dispatchers to better deploy crews. DC Water shared with IBM all kinds of data related to its water system. And then in January 2010, researchers from the IBM Watson and China Labs used that data in creating analytics models and solutions components. Through December 2010, the Folk team worked closely with DC Water's CIO office and operational staff to develop scenarios where analytics and other technologies could be put to work. This included a fix-it-before-it-breaks system for early fault detection and failure prediction through predictive analytics, a while-in-the-neighborhood scheduling system based on spatial scheduling tools, and a water use analysis program to keep track of and forecast water usage and detect usage anomalies. The technology was ready to be tested. The DC Water operational staff and IBM started to test and evaluate the different analytics approaches. Broken water meters were being identified in a timely manner. And all over the city, crews were being dispatched in a coordinated fashion and began to tackle more work with less driving between jobs. For example, if a crew happened to be in a certain location on assignment, the technology was smart enough to alert workers to other open ticket items in the same neighborhood, saving them from having to make an extra trip on another day. And understanding water usage of DC water customers during different times of the year is leading to initiatives in support of water conservation and reduced pollution. Timely access to relevant information has always been critical to business success. And as DC Water discovered, bringing greater intelligence and connectedness into its operations would go a long way toward creating a truly integrated and smarter water system, and most importantly, satisfying its thousands of customers. 
And as all the folk projects are proving, it is the dynamic nature of this close interaction with IBM clients and the changing forces of the real world that drives innovation and brings it to market at an ever-quickening pace. The end.